Small triangle! Sticky octopus. This month is all about animals that are squishy, prickly, and sticky. Oh, hi, Small Fry. It's me, Allie. Hi, Auntie Carol here. And me, Aurelia. <laughs> We're just trying to get these suction cups off this glass. It's so sticky, isn't it? Hi, guys. Looks like you're having a hard time with the suction cups. We really are. It's super sticky. It reminds me of an octopus. Yeah, octopus have really sticky suckers on their arms. Would you guys like to meet an octopus today? Yes! yes. Come on, friends, let's go! So this is Zisu. He is a giant Pacific octopus. Do you guys see all his arms? Wow! wow. Let's count how many arms there are. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Whoa. Eight arms. Wow. Right. Do you guys see these round sticky parts? Yeah. yeah. These are called suction cups. Can we touch them? You can, yeah. Just be gentle. Wow, that's so sticky. Wow, that really feels like suction cups. Do you need help touching them? Yeah. Okay. I'll let you up. Just feel the back of his arm to start if you want. Here you go. Here you go. If you touch the suction cups, trick that the octopus can play. <laughs> so sometimes they like to spray wow. us too. And those are, they don't hurt at all, but yeah. that is how the suction cups wow. stick to your heart. Those suction cups are really sticky, aren't they? They are super sticky. And this is a pretty good view here, so you can kind of see that little ball there. Yeah. There's a bunch of little muscles in there, and that's how he's able to hold on to this. <laughs> The other cool thing about these sucker discs is he's able to taste everything that he's touching. So he knows me pretty well. Yeah. That's why he's crawling all the way up my arm. And then there's something else pretty cool that you can see on the arms here. If you look really, really close, so do you see all those little polka dots on his arm? Yeah. Right over there. We call those, this is a big word. These are chromatophores. Big word alert. What's a chromatophore? So chromatophores are the way that octopus can change color. They have tiny little pigment pockets in their skin. And these guys, they have red and brown pigments. So when they open up those little pockets, that's when you get to see the bright colors. And then when they close them up, that's when you get a white color. Aurelia, what color do you think the octopus is? It's kind of like a brownish color. Oh, yeah. great. Different species can be different colors, but these guys, we generally see them uh, red, pinkish, kind of brownish, and his mouth is, he's showing us a really good view, so his mouth is going to be right in the middle of all of those arms, so right in the center. Aurelia, what was your favorite thing that you learned about the octopus today? That has eight arms. Eight arms, that's right. Let's count how many arms there are. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Thank you so much, Ken, for showing us Zizu. Thank you, Zizu. <laughs> Small fry, next time you touch something sticky, think of an octopus and think of Zizu and his sticky suction cups on his arms. We'll see you soon. Thanks for swimming by Small Fry School.